<laughs> Move over. Move, bitch. Okay. Um, anyone who knows me knows four things about me. I'm tall. I'm skinny. Mm -hmm. I'm black. And I love me some Janet Jackson. That is true. Yes. I remember the first time... I remember the first time I heard the song Nasty playing kickball in Randy Powell's front yard as the radio blared on the ghetto blaster when I heard this sound unlike anything I'd ever heard before. It was fresh, it was funky, it was female, it was nasty. And it was Janet Jackson. I was instantly and forevermore hooked. The point is, we all wanted to be like Janet. We wanted to dance like her or be that guy in her video. This music superstar has influenced a generation of performers, everyone from Beyonce to Christina. Their songs, choreography, costumes, videos, stage shows, they're all lovingly ripping pages from the Janet Jackson playbook, even if she doesn't always get the credit. But we know the real deal. We're proud to present the Always Next Forever Now Award to Miss Janet Jackson. <laughs> Thank you very much, and, and I'm, I'm really honored to receive the Always Next Forever Now Award. I want to thank all of you, as well as thanking Patrick and Rodney for presenting me with this award. The gay, lesbian, bisexual, and transgender communities have supported me for such a long time. You guys have always been there for me, and I've, I've always felt the love. I've received a number of awards during my career, but, but those closest to my heart are from the gay lesbian, bisexual, and transgender communities. The AIDS LA and the Vanguard Award from GLAAD are very special to me as well. Thank you once again for this, and have a wonderful evening.